Okay. Maybe that's better? I don't know. I don't know, you know? Okay, this is really weird. I haven't streamed for a while. A lot of weird stuff has happened recently. Playtime. Cool. Let's check out the gallery. Let's see what we got here. Oh, cool. Okay. Okay, so you have to buy stuff with money. That's cool. Okay. That's really neat. Oh my gosh! DuckTales! Woohoo! Welcome, Downright Bass! Um, welcome back, Downright Bass. I'm gonna be honest. I was terrified that I would never talk to you again. <laughs> because something... I don't know if you noticed, but my, my Twitch channel got suspended. <laughs> um, and it's... <sighs> Why did I do easy? Yeah, my, my Twitch channel got suspended indefinitely for having an offensive username. But... They... They reversed the ban. They said that it was their mistake, but I'm still really curious what happened. Yeah. I don't know. I. <laughs> it's hilarious. You were actually there. You were there trying to help me figure out a new name because we were doing that. And then after the stream, probably an hour or so later, they banned me. And uh, <laughs> I just thought that was so funny. That the stream where we were talking about changing the name happened right before I actually got banned for the name. Just, it didn't make much sense. But, I'm back. Uh, I, everything seems okay. I still have affiliate. I can still see my followers. Uh, I think the notification got to you. Uh, my videos came back. Originally, I couldn't find any of my videos. But they came back. And now... Um, now all the videos are back. I actually added a bunch of videos um, because I'm freaking out about losing all my highlights now. So I, I've been trying to highlight a lot of things, but it turns out that you can only export or you can only add 99 videos to YouTube a day, or at least I could today. After that, it stopped uploading, so I need to wait until tomorrow to start doing more. Um, I seriously don't see how your name can possibly be offensive. There are theories out there. I don't want to discuss them too much on here. Um, I don't want to discuss them on here, but there are theories, and I, I did discuss that uh, the name, for some reason, is causing a lot of strife with certain people. So I think... Honestly, someone on that game show channel I've been watching maybe reported it, and uh, it's really unfortunate. I, I think they got mad that I was better at blockbusters than they were. Golly, how many videos do you have? Uh, on Twitch right now, I think it's 263, but um, on YouTube it's now like 700, because I... I uh, I split up the videos into 15 minute segments now because I feel like that's easier to digest as a consumer and I want to try and help people uh, like my content more. <laughs> I don't want people to have to sit through four hours of, an, of like the sixth Injustice 2 stream. I just want to split it into segments, so it's it's a lot more videos on YouTube than there are on Twitch because of that. Hung like a frog, welcome. Infinity War, OMG. I expected too much from Infinity War, it wasn't too good. Huh. Infinity War, OMG. I expected too much. <laughs> It wasn't too good. I'm sorry to hear that. Also, my old name was reported and banned too. Yeah, hung like a frog. It makes sense why your name was banned. <laughs> I don't want you to put it in the chat, but uh, suffice to say, <laughs> hung like a frog's original name was... Actually, no, you can see it on his profile. If you click on his profile, it says, oh, formerly known as this, this, this. That makes sense. 
That makes sense why that was banned. No offense. I don't know why Try Hard Troglodyte was banned. You unlucky fellows. Maybe it's good I took the cripple out of my name. Honestly, I think that would that was a good decision if you were if you really did have cripple in there at one point. I think uh, I think that's a good idea. In in today's climate, it's that's not a great name to have. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> um, but it don't... I mean, come on. Let's let's not have sympathy for Hung Like a Frog. He, his name was terrible. No offense. <laughs> I, it was funny. I was looking up names. Like, some people said, Oh, you know, my name was banned on Twitch, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, okay, maybe this is a big thing. But their names were horrible. I mean, it was clearly offensive. Or it was clear why it was offensive. <laughs> um, whereas with Try Hard Troglodyte, we really have to guess, and there's no real answer what happened. They, they said it was a mistake. I'm not entirely convinced by that. I think someone did report it, and then they just realized, hey, that's not really a... Oh, whoops. <laughs> Need to do it the other way. My bad. Um, hey, that's, that's not that offensive. <laughs> so... Are you going to see Infinity War? Uh, yeah, I am. Of course I am. Uh, I only know one person that's not going to see it. I won't name them, but I'm very disappointed in them for <laughs> for not seeing it. Just kidding. If you're watching, I'm just kidding. I'm not disappointed in you. If you're not watching, I'm still disappointed in you. Just kidding. Uh, I, I am going to watch it. I want to wait until I see Black Panther, though. I, I feel like it would be important to watch Black Panther. Uh, it seems like the Wakanda army features prominently in the film. So I kind of want to... Oh, here we go. I don't remember this in the NES game. I don't remember this at all. I feel like this is a tutorial stage that they just added for the remaster. Um, the... Yeah, it seems like the Wakandan army features prominently, and I don't want to... I, I feel like they're, they're going to talk about some stuff that was probably revealed in Black Panther, and I don't want to be spoiled of it in that way. I just want to watch the movie. So I'm, I'm going to either wait until it comes out digitally, which is May 8th, or I will head to the theater and see it, because it, it is still in Congo theaters, so... Ooh, 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 hey. <laughs> um, I was Cripple to Bassist Quest. Oh, okay, like a, a quest to go from Cripple to Bassist. I see. Uh, yeah, Cripple seems a little loaded there. <laughs> uh, even if the intentions were nice, the that word is a little... It's a little loaded. Maybe handicapped to bassist quest. I don't know. I don't know if you could win with that one. So I'm I'm actually quite a big fan of your name now. I thought it was clever, but people kept getting uncomfortable. So I could see that. I I checked out your channel, by the way. I noticed that. I thought last I checked, your channel had only maybe half a dozen videos, but then I checked recently, as in last night when I got unbanned, because well, no, I could see your stuff before that, but I couldn't see my followers, I couldn't see my messages, I couldn't see my friends, I couldn't even watch videos without ads. <laughs> my Twitch Prime got suspended at the same time. Um, not, I, no, that sounded weird. I, the Twitch Prime was connected to my Twitch, and since my Twitch was suspended, the Twitch Prime was inactive. That's what I should say. Uh, it was it was very frustrating, but anyways, I watched I looked at your channel and you had a ton more videos like from your original streams uh, back in I think 2000. Oh, let's see, 2016, 2015. I don't know. You had you had a lot more videos. I thought maybe I just couldn't see them before. Also, how the heck? Oh my gosh. <clears throat> differently abled to basis quest. <laughs> That's a good one. I actually, <laughs> I think that would actually fly. I think that would. 
Uh, by the way, I've been listening to some other videos of mine. I actually I thought it would be fun to look at my very first stream ever uh, as Tryhard Troglodyte, and oh man, it was it was bad. Uh, not not in terms of the language, just how many verbal pauses I used. And I know that I'm not I'm still not great with them, but it was so much worse back then. Uh, recently, I have been looking at some of my recent videos, saying, "Ah, oh, man, that's those are a lot of verbal pauses," but. The further I go back in time, the the more I hear the verbal pauses, so it's... Yeah. Must have been 2016. Those videos have been up for a long time. That's strange. Maybe I just was blind. Maybe I was blind. Because I, I swear I only saw your two streams, and then the highlighted versions of those streams, and then maybe one song that was highlighted. I think that was it. Weird. I don't know how to get this. <laughs> Look at you growing as a streamer. Thank you. I was really sad. I've told everybody this, actually. <laughs> I, I was really sad. I, I got DuckTales Remastered, and I realized, oh, no, it doesn't have the original DuckTales in it. But then, in that same transaction, I did also get Disney Afternoon Collection. And as it turns out, that game actually has DuckTales 1 and 2. The original versions. Okay, I'm going to give up on that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I can't do it. I know you're not supposed to say that, but... Wait, 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 wait. No, I don't think so. Nice! I'm not a fan of that. I'm not a fan of having to jump into a certain area or hit a certain area and then it shows the um it shows it it activates like an emblem but then you have to still pick it up i don't like that i think we've already talked about that though wait 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 a second how do you hold dob oh oh okay 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 so here we go we got to there we go. Okay, we got that. And then we gotta do this. Ooh! Oh, man! No! That was tough. That was scary. I didn't like that. Um, oh, by the way, I updated my video banner. See, I'm still, I'm still pondering changing my name. But right now I have the text as Tryhard Troglodyte, but I changed my video banner so when I'm offline, it looks different. I don't know if it looks better, but I was pretty happy with it. I also got a little help from Wolfric Coda. He's a uh, he's he has a proclivity for graphic design, and I wanted and uh, I utilized his assistance, so it looks a lot better uh, in the way it's formatted. Oh, come on. <laughs> and you'll you'll see it when I go offline, or I also have a like special version for when I go offline on the actual stream. Uh, when I'm ending the stream, I should say it's it no longer says see you later, blah blah blah. It's 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 nicer, I think. I kind of want to take those old videos of mine down just because I look so darn unhappy. Oh, you actually said darn. <laughs> Uh, but you know, gotta preserve history and all that, and it's not like my streams are masterful performance now either. Sometimes I really think low standards are the key to happiness. Oh, well that's just sad. That's sad, downright base. Why are you saying that, man? I... <clears throat> I would agree with, I mean, I would, <laughs> I would support the decision, the thought process behind wanting to take them down, because I've gone through that thinking, oh man, these streams, m mine are because, not because I'm, I look unhappy, but because I want to try and efface history, <laughs> I want to make it seem like my streams are, have never been swear fests. It's it's difficult though to take those stuff those things down because they are their history like you said so I, I understand the the struggle 
I guess, is what I'm trying to say. But see, it's actually happy if you don't care. This isn't supposed to be as twisted as it sounds. Um, you know, I, I trust that your intentions are, are positive. <laughs> I was telling people about the Nancy Drew conversation we had the other day. Oh man, that was that was great. That was a great conversation. I never did watch it though. Uh, speaking of things I'm probably not going to watch uh, for a while, I think I decided that. I mean, there's such a big chance that wh whoever reported me was in the buzzer chat that I think it's just not a good idea for me to play to to watch that channel anymore or at least engage with it as much as I I have been Oh wow that was a uh, that was real bad There we go Ooh I I swear I don't know I've never I don't remember this at all I I've played the original Oh no. But I don't remember this at all. Your safety is securely suspended. Ooh yeah. Give me that life. Ooh. Uh sorry. Try differently abled. <laughs> don't know why I said it that way. <laughs> differently abled troglodyte. They odd to welcome back, welcome you back with open arms. I, you know, that actually might be what I do. Not, not that name. I'm not a huge fan of that name. No offense. Uh, but I, I will probably return when my name changes. If I change my name, it's so hard to think of a better name than Try Hard Troglodyte. I just, I love it so much. <sighs> Although MBF put her comment in that Trago Doggo, she she thinks that's fine. Uh, she she's a pretty good barometer of things. Like she'll or sounding board maybe. Uh, if she doesn't like something, she'll tell me. And I feel like I've improved my stream quite a bit because of her. So I trust her judgment. I trust her input too. So Trago Doggo may in fact be the name. I don't remember a story in the NES game either. <laughs> oh, that's right. I remember when this game came out, it was such a huge deal that I believe the entire voice cast came back for it. I think. And I think the person it looks that way, lads. <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? I think the person that plays Scrooge McDuck passed away shortly after the game came out or I don't know. Okay, this is this is more like what I remember. <laughs> you can change the levels. You can <clears throat> that's that's not really stupid. Uh, it, you, you can uh, choose which level you go to. I look forward to the name change with wonder and intrigue. <laughs> well, I'm sorry that I may have spoiled it just now. <laughs> I really hope it works out, though, for the followers. Um, like, my, my stream is very small right now, so I don't think too many people will be affected. But I know, like, if, if I were a bigger streamer, a name change could be devastating, but I think that this is a great time to do that. I did a little spring cleaning actually. I, I changed my picture on Twitch. I changed it to a picture of Espy and Ishmael instead of Grumpy Cat with no. I don't know why I ever put that as the picture. <laughs> I think because I wasn't comfortable putting myself up maybe, or I don't know, whatever the case is. I changed that. And also, if you scroll to the top of the video, you should see a new video banner, which is... It has... It no longer has the, the Morton salt thing. I, I took away the salt, <laughs> and I I moved the pictures around, and I added my socials on there, so... Uh, it, I think it's 
I don't know, I'm, I'm pretty proud of what I did there. Let's see, Infinity War is overrated in my opinion. Okay. I'm I'm sorry you feel that way. It it's uh it's unfortunate when you look forward to a movie and it turns out to just not be everything you hoped it would be. Kinda a shame after so many years of build up. Oh, Infinity War. I thought you meant my my Twitch channel. I was like, uh, <laughs> it's only been like <laughs> Nine months. I don't know. I, I've had one baby since I started. Thanks for the lift launch, I think, actually. No lift is one yeah, I think so. August 10th, 2017, I think, was my first stream. So August to September, September to October, October to November, November to December, December to January, January to February, February to March, March to April. So May 10th would be my my baby. May 10th is when the babies do. And you bet I'm gonna do a stream about that. <laughs> I had so much expectation for it. No doggo, your channel is mastery. Wait, what? No doggo, your channel is mastery. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I got what you were saying now. Thank you. <laughs> oh no, it's Donkey Kong. Oh, it's a really weird version of Donkey Kong. What the heck? Also, I would really appreciate if you'd take that tutorial message out of my face. Thank you. Okay, now this game's getting a little more exciting. For some reason, you know, as much as as great as the game looks, I'm not a huge fan of this art style. It's very it just feels a little bland. I I don't know. That doesn't sound like the right. It, it, okay, not bland. It looks like a lot of work went into it, but I'm not a huge fan of the way they did this. Especially with the 3D power-ups, the 2D characters. It just doesn't. It doesn't make sense. It makes a mission. Oh jeez. I don't want to touch the snake. Whoa, my gosh. Hello. <gasps> oh, it's a secret area. Look at that. I'm so good. Actually, you know what? The pogo stuff is making me it's putting me in Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze mode. So Nine months? Shoot, I must have been here nearly since the beginning. I think so. You were you've been here for a long time. You are absolutely OG, yes. Did I teach you that word? I, I taught someone OG recently. And I I, I wasn't sure if it was you. <laughs> but someone someone wasn't sure what OG meant. Oh no. Oh wow, that got violent. Holy crap. No! Yeah, you taught me that? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was... Okay. I wasn't sure. I was really sad. I reached the 99 video limit on YouTube right when it was going to upload the affiliate stream. Because I, I, you know, I did a whole stream on affiliate. And it was, it was basically a family reunion. It was great. <laughs> uh, you were there. Uh, Hans Jeremy Zhang was there. It was it was like a whole family reunion when I was playing Tony Hawk 3 especially. It was great. Uh, but I, I tried to upload the whole stream to YouTube. And then I tried to split it up into the, the specific games. And it's at that point that that YouTube said, Hey, you can't, you can't send us any more videos, you silly goose. And I was sad. How do you get these ones that are near the top of the screen? I don't like it, dude. Oh, there we go. That worked. Oh, it's a birthday cake. It's a piece of cake to bake a pretty cake. A coin the 
if the way is easy. You gotta do the cooking by the book. You know you can't be lazy. It was interesting. My Call of Duty streams had no muted audio on Twitch, but on YouTube, all of them have copyright claims on them, so that's cool. Apparently, Synthwave is not as safe of a music genre as I thought, in terms of people getting their, uh, their grapes smushed, but not in a good way, meaning wine. They're getting their grapes smushed because they wanted grapes, and then they get them smushed. And when you, have, if you've ever looked at a smushed grape, it's not, it's not delectable. It's not enticing. It's a terrible thing. So they have their grapes smushed, and that's not good. <clears throat> well, that wasn't great. <laughs> Yes. Oh, that spider's so creepy, dude. No! Oh, oh, okay. I'll take it. <laughs> oh! This is too hard. Too hard, guys. This is too difficult for me. What? I don't understand. I don't understand. Oh, you actually have to like... Okay. You can't be doing this the whole time. You actually have to stop from time to time. So we're gonna actually practice that a little bit. Oh man, that's not good. Oh no, that's not good. Oh man, <laughs> I died. Okay. Oh, good. Thank you for the health that I could have used, probably. There we go. Interesting. That's an interesting mechanic that's very difficult to wrap my head around for some reason. Oh, and also, I can confirm that if you use... OBS to flip the kitty on the screen, it will put everything backwards. <laughs> I thought that that was going to happen, but I was hoping that it wouldn't so that I could not have to sign into the website where I got him and change his orientation, but no, it absolutely does it backwards. It's very strange. I'm wondering if for April Fool's Day I should do that, uh, which, which I do realize April Fool's Day did just pass us about three weeks ago. Four, almost four. Oh, take off with a no no. The kitty appreciate the num num. <laughs> I hope that's evident, because he, he should be thanking you for the num nums. That was not a good idea. Why did I do that? That boulder was there for some reason. I'm not sure why. Okay. Oh, yes! Secret area! Wow! <gasps> Look at all the treasure, dude! Oh, no! Can I still get the, the treasure chest? I feel like I had to jump off of it and then go to the others. Oh, he did. Kitty has an attitude of gratitude. I love that. That's great. Oh, thank goodness. We don't have to do that. Okay, cool. Um. What a strange way to use a pogo stick. <laughs> also, hold on. It's not a pogo stick. It's a cane. <laughs> I don't know why that took me a while to figure out. Yes! And uh, I'm glad that the kitty has an attitude of gratitude. That's good. 
That's good. I taught him well. Uh, no, we don't need to go here. Yeah! Oh, jeez. Oh, okay, so we have to use the B to get over there, I think. Otherwise, the little piranha plants. <sighs> well. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> we'll just ignore that. We'll just ignore everything that just happened. How's that sound, everybody? Ooh! Donkey Kong! Get out of here! Wait. Hold on. We are doing like the same level over again. I don't understand what, what happened. I mean, I, I don't think we died here, did we? Hike! Ooh. Ooh! Boom! Oh, Donkey Kong! Get on my level, bro! DK, a woo! DK, a woo! <laughs> oh, I love it. Some of these enemies. You're gonna have to do a little research. Some of this stuff really feels like Donkey Kong, though. Uh, the the bees... I don't know, maybe I'm just used to the... Maybe it's because I love Donkey Kong Country, I'm obsessed with it. But those bees, the patterns they're flying in, definitely not... Definitely not unlike the... Of course, you know, I sell it, say that I'm obsessed with the games. I can't even name the enemies. <laughs> the little, the yellow jackets. They're... I don't think they're called stingers. I think there is a stinger, but it's in Donkey Kong Country 3. I'm talking about the yellow and black fellows. Like uh, Wiz Khalifa song. Black and yellow. Which is, I believe, about his favorite sports team. Come in, launch pad. I found something. Or a carving of is it about a car? A stone slab. And eight or is it about both? He is a master lyricist, I'm sure. Does it tell us how to find the treasure? Well, I'm not sure what it tells us, but I'm certain it's an important clue. Downright base, have you played Donkey Kong Country before? These coins I found will fit perfectly into those notches. Ah, you must have come across an ancient Incan poker table, Mr. McDee. How about I come down there? Ancient Incan poker table. You come down here and I'll deal you a blow to the head. You're supposed to be keeping an eye out for trouble, remember? <laughs> All right, trouble spotting it is. Launch pad. What if the images on these coins symbolize I've sure tried. I was always terrible at it, but I do love them all. Maybe if I surround him That's what I like to hear. My wife is killer good at them. Nice! That's awesome. From what you've played, do you have a favorite? I don't know why I'm trying to be a little quiet during these cutscenes. It's not exactly the... The ancient city of Manco Capquac. And that beam of light. It must be pointing to the Temple of the Clouds. It's not exactly the most enthralling tale. Up here, Mr. McD. Oh my gosh, it's the, 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 the guy. With the, the thing. <laughs> okay. Thank goodness we can... Okay. <laughs> I thought maybe there was a secret area or something, but no. <laughs> no, nope, you just need to get on the thing. Oh, oh, okay, so you jump? That's good game design. That's good game design. They showed me a, a gem, and I have an addiction to collecting gems. Not gem in the holograms, but these, ki the you know, brilliant kind of gems. Uh, and the developers were like, we need to put gems down here. 
and then people will jump down and try and get them and then they'll realize that this whole level is actually supposed to be you jump down and you do stuff okay there's gotta be something down here no okay I, I don't I don't trust it go I don't think I know enough to pick a favorite the first one is the most sentimental for me though so there's oh, that I yes I found a legendary temple of Manco Capquack. Uh, same same for me actually D Donkey Kong Country 1 has the sentimental power um, and even if you take away the sentimentality though it, it's it's such a great game talking completely objectively and unbiased it's such a good game <laughs> um, definitely looked like a Donkey Kong Country secret area that was tricky yes I agree I think I think I have Donkey Kong on the mind. What do you say? <laughs> Wait, can we go up here? <gasps> it's a secret area. It's a secret area. Look at all that treasure! Oh, it's a cake. I don't I don't like cake. Cake's not a treasure to me. Cake is a gateway to diabetes. That's what it is for me. Nice, nice, nice. Hashtag troth. Oh, I, I utilized my Twitter for the first time to say that I'm going online. And I I used a, an Alexa Bliss gif. Alexa Bliss is my favorite wrestler. And she she has a Harley Quinn aesthetic. <laughs> okay. That was scary. <laughs> Uh, she has a Harley Quinn aesthetic, which makes me love her, obviously, because Harley Quinn is my favorite comic thing ever. Comic. She's not exactly a heroine, but I don't think she's a villain either. I mean, she's kind of like Catwoman. I love her, though. So, I love Alexa Bliss. Mostly because of that, and also, I don't know. She just, I've seen her on a show called Total Divas. And she seems like a really nice lady. I really like it. I like her. I love how nice she is. Is this a bad person? I'm not sure. I didn't realize you had a favorite wrestler. Uh, don't get excited. <laughs> I, for a little while there, meaning probably for a few weeks, I was kind of obsessed with wrestling. Maybe even a month or two. But it's just kind of waning now for me. And I, I feel really bad because one of my friends, actually a couple of my friends, they were really excited to talk to me about wrestling when I finally started enjoying it. But, I don't know. It's, it's, it's just not great for me right now. I'm not a huge fan. Um, and also, a big part of it is that I care more about the women in wrestling. I do not like the men much. Uh, for some reason, I was obsessed with Dean Ambrose for a little while, but... That's not... No. <laughs> There's no basis for that! So, I don't know. It. I was... Yeah. That's fair. I got about two years out of it. <laughs> I think that's longer than me. <laughs> Unless you count Alexa Bliss. Alexa Bliss I'll probably love till the end of time. Although I was really sad when someone told me that they don't like her because she's just a bully. And it's at that point I learned that Alexa Bliss is a heel. I did not know that. I thought she was a face. But, I don't know. It makes sense to me why I don't like wrestling so much when it's the men. It, it's the same reason I don't like fighting games that have only one female fighter <laughs> it's I, I don't I don't think it has to do with looks I think it just I'm more comfortable with them I don't know it's because I was actually bullied in school uh, elementary to middle school I was bullied heavily exclusively by men and I kind of found solace in women uh, my mom and my sisters for instance so I, I think that just kind of carried over, and I don't, I don't know. 
Anyways, that got a little personal, sorry. Uh, now I'm trying to develop a love for baseball, but I don't think that's going to pan out. Meh, she'll probably have a face turn before too long. I hope so. As far as baseball goes, <laughs> it's funny. I was actually... Um, there's a game called... There's a game called... Ugh, it's like Rusty's... Oh, crap. I don't remember the name of it. It's a game where you are like a dog, and I think his name is Rusty. It's on the 3DS. It starts as a free download, I think. You can download it for free, and you can play one of the mini games, and then you buy the other ones individually, I believe. Oh, Really? You can't you can't sideswipe him with the cane? Oh come on, bro. Uh I always liked girls more than guys. I think I can see where you're coming from. Guys are dumb, except for us and Hans and Frog. Yeah, there are exceptions. There are absolutely exceptions. And there are exceptions to the idea that women are way better. <laughs> Because I've known, you know, some, some women have kind of ruined the illusion a bit for me. But, you know. Oh, no. No. There we go. Ooh. <clears throat> uh. I'm not even 100% convinced that Han, that uh, Hung Like a Frog is a male. I feel like they could. I mean, they've never said. I don't know. There it is, the king's scepter. Well, <laughs> oh, this was easier to find than a penny in a parking lot. A penny in a parking lot? How many pennies do you find in parking lots, dude? That doesn't make any sense. Catch me, catch I'm a male. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Mystery solved. Oh. Oh, no! Yes! I do not like the collision on that, though. Oh, okay, the collision was better on that one. It felt like I just kind of s slid through him, which is just kind of weird. Oh. oh no! I wonder if you lose automatically if you get hit by that. Um, sorry, I, I see a couple messages. Let me let me do this real quick. Okay, sorry. Um. Oh, Dynasty Warriors 9 has a bunch of female characters, and I do find a charm to playing as them. And hey, in this installment, most of them are even wearing clothes, so that's nice. <laughs> um, I don't want to comment on that too much. Uh, I, I will say that I respect... A, a woman's decision to wear what she wants. And I don't necessarily complain <laughs> if it's not much. That's all I'll say. Family friendly stream, everybody. Family friendly stream. Although it's really strange. With Injustice 2, I was offended by how little coverage their clothes had. It was very... It was weird. It was really weird to me that... Like, in that context, I was actually kind of offended. I felt like it took away from them as characters, but that's not even true. Because they're... I don't know. Like, they're still strong. It's not like they're just... Eye candy. They are still very strong women. And that's a... That's a worry that's that I've seen people put out there for when a woman 
in a movie where it's almost nothing. It's it's almost like she adds nothing to the movie except her looks. And while I don't think that's necessarily untrue for certain things, I, I definitely don't think it's true for Supergirl and Starfire, Poison Ivy. Like, they're so self-sufficient. They're so powerful on their own. I don't necessarily agree with the uh, that issue. Which is why it's so weird that I'm so offended. Not Not offended. I think it's like, it's not even that offended. It's like, I I am sad sometimes when I see Starfire, her best clothes are like, skimpy. I don't know. It's a weird dichotomy. Well, now that you mention it, uh, I did come here looking for... Are these supposed to be Tasmanian tigers? Perhaps named Ty? They look just like Ty the Tasmanian tiger. Hey, yo, SP. I was gonna ask about Dynasty Warriors 9, actually. I was interested in it, maybe. I was wondering if you're uh, if you're still enjoying it. Are you still playing it a lot? We beat a level. I'm so excited. Oh, we can buy so much now. Heck yeah, man. I love how I said I don't want to comment on that much, and I still commented on it heavily. <laughs> Speaking of things that are <clears throat> heavily... Uh, yesterday I woke up randomly wanting to listen to the song In Time by Robbie Robb, which I think, if you're a fan of late 80s movies... You will know that that is a that is a song that features prominently, heavily, in the first Bill and Ted movie, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. I had this urge to listen to it for some weird reason, <laughs> and then I listened to it, and then I decided I want to watch the Bill and Ted movies. So I I did not I did not watch them. I did buy them though. <laughs> I don't know why I stopped there. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's pretty cool. I don't know why I had that urge. It's so weird. Yeah, less than before because I'm trying to be mildly a mildly useful part of the human race. But in my many idler hours, it's all about DW9. <clears throat> okay. I see. What do you mean you're trying to be a mildly useful part of the human race? <laughs> All right, do you did you get a job or? Cause I, <clears throat> I, on the way home from an appointment I had, I actually stopped by a computer repair shop, and I gave them my number and I said, "Hey, you're looking for someone in the Congo that knows computers, yes?" And they're like, "Yeah," and I was like, "Yeah," it was care. <laughs> I think I'm coming up on 200 hours. Wow, nice. That's awesome. I've heard complaints from more modern gamers about the graphics and frame rate and such. I think they're utter they're I think they're utterly amazing, sorry. But I'm also quite retro and have never played a PS4 before. You might not admire it visually as much as I do. Oh, I see. I see what you're saying. Um yeah, frame rate frame rate is kind of a big deal for me right now. I don't know why it's such a big deal. It never used to be, but Back your bags, boys. We're off to Transylvania and <clears throat> coming back without the It is kind of a big deal for me. But mostly if I played it on a console actually, I probably wouldn't care as much. I hope. <laughs> because 
at least on a computer, I know that my computer is capable of playing it at that at a better rate than it's going, and therefore I have a lot more room to be frustrated when it doesn't work right for me in my paradigm. But if it's a PlayStation 4 game, if I played it on PlayStation 4 or Xbox One, I, I don't know, it might not bother me as much. Maybe. Otherwise, though, it's a pretty solid game with the continuing patches, if I interpret the feelings of the internet accurately. Oh, that's good. Are people starting to not turn on it as much now? I'm sure you'll still admire the ladies, though. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> PS4 Pro is supposed to be a pretty smooth ride for it, I think. Oh, I don't... I don't have a PS4 Pro. It's funny. I keep talking about frame rate, but I didn't spring for the PS4 Pro. Actually, you know what happened? The PS4 Slim came out, and I bought it, I think, the day it came out. And then, like a month later, is when I got my computer. And that's when I turned into a frame rate proclivitor. I don't think proclivitor is a word, but I, I don't care. It's a good word to make up, so... <clears throat> I like that. That's kind of fun. Oh, dang! Look at that diamond, bro! Speaking of retro downright bass, are you familiar with Double Dare, a game show on Nickelodeon? I wish I could say whether or not the regular PS4 was smooth after the patches, but really I have no eye for these things. Well, are you playing on the regular PS4? Because... I mean, I, I trust you. I trust your judgment. Tell you the truth, I think the inaccessible story and Chinese names and such would be the biggest hurdle for you or anybody. Whoa. Hey. Whoa. Hey. You know, I, I effectively major in linguistics, and I love, I love to look at names from other languages and cultures and read about the story of their names. So I don't think that would be a barrier for me at all, actually, period. <laughs> that, that would actually be something I'd want to play it for. But inaccessible story, I'm not sure what you mean by that. Uh, yeah, I borrowed my brother-in-law's PS4. I just can't tell the difference between frame rate. Never noticed frame drops. Don't know much about it. I gotcha. You know, there are some people that scoff at the idea that some people can't see frame rates, but I think it's absolutely possible. Especially if, if you don't like read about it and see it for yourself frequently like if you're a pc gamer if you were a pc gamer i would think that um frame rates you'd be able to see them a lot more because there's just such a dis there's there's such a vast variety oh gosh bless you sb what was that um there's such a vast variety of games and even more variable frame rates. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm rereading the books at the same time. Sorry, sorry. Let me read the first one. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, it is freaking interesting. I usually say heckin' for that. Sorry. Let me restart. Uh, well, it is heckin' interesting. It's just so dosh, dosh garn foreign to most people. I actually play it mostly because I love the story so dang much. I'm rereading the books at the same time, in fact. So, I'm still a little unclear on what you meant by inaccessible story. 
Also, apparently all my my children or nephews, my relatives are all uh, being locked up. I, I don't know when that happened. I think I may have missed it. I will say I watched an old VHS on an old TV recently, and for the first time it occurred to me that the resolution wasn't as good as I'd wish. It made me feel modern. You know, <clears throat> downright base. That's a good. That's a good revelation to have about. What, what year is it? 2018. Hmm. I'm gonna say that you're about 20 years late on that one. <laughs> But I'm glad that it came to you eventually. <laughs> That's good. Uh, yeah, watching VHSs on old TVs this is... Watching VHSs on new TVs? Terrible. Watching VHSs on old TVs? Uh, not as terrible. Same, same with playing old games on older TVs. It's not as terrible. But it's still not good. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my gosh. What is going on? Oh, man. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> this, uh, this ghost is very, 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 very determined. I don't like it. There we go. Let's see. Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, yeah! Ro! Is a character in Winnie the Pooh. It's a kangaroo. How many oohs can we say? Glue. Boo. Do. New. Sue. Foo. Loo. Goo. Um... Rude, rude, sued. Sued, sued is like French for south. Uh, L'Afrique du Sud. It's South Africa. Um, L'Amérique du Sud. That is South America. Well, in most games, it's pretty straightforward with easily learned places and names and such. In DW, there's literally hundreds of characters going back and forth through the provinces, and all the people and places have Chinese names that would that are practically practically indistinguishable when you start. I see. Like at one point, Cao Cao has three strategists helping him named uh, Shun. Shun Yu, Shun Yo, and Shu Yo. Okay, that does sound a little excessive, I'll be honest. But I wouldn't give up on it. I think that I, I welcome that. That seems pretty cool. I'm sure I mis mispronounced those, by the way, but, um, Shun, Shun Yu, not Shun Yu. Um, okay. I was going to give you credit anyways, actually, but now you're getting extra credit. Oh, you have to... <laughs> You have to duck. My bad. No pun intended! Because you're a duck! And it's duck tails. I am so funny. Please subscribe to me so you can use Espy as an emote. And feel obligated to watch my streams and listen to how funny I am. <laughs> ah! Trash! I didn't know there was going to be a second part to that.
I would be so very happy to answer any questions if you ever end up playing or streaming that game. I don't get many chances to share my love of the Three Kingdoms. Yeah, I uh, I mean, it's not in the books right now, but it is something I've thought about, and I, I think I have it on my wish list on Steam, actually. Um, oh, hey, perfect time for me to die, actually. Uh, the kitties need their their nighttime num nums, so I will actually be right back. I was I was gonna work on a new be right back picture, but unfortunately, I kind of locked myself in to start a stream eight minutes from the time that I sent the tweet. So, anyways, okay, I will be right back. Okay, sorry about that. The kitties have their num nums, and my neighbors are probably very annoyed with me. Oh yeah, I need to show the game now, right? There you go. Um. Okay. Oh, don't go for the num num. Oh wow, that was scary. I thought I died. Okay, cool. Okay, how do I, uh, let's see. Nice! I didn't actually see this thing here. I am blind. I'm glad you liked the, the, the duck joke. Oh, really? You can't hit the freaking the the ghost the, the ghost. You can't hit the that ghost. You have to. That's stupid. That's stupid. <laughs> num nums for all kids. <laughs> I think my neighbors hate me though because uh, when when dinner time is here, I, I sing to the kitties. I sing something like, "It's time for the num num to the kitty kitties." It's the night time. No, no. I don't, it's, it gets weird. I don't know. Speaking of scraps, he dropped this out of Scrooge. Ah, it looks like another piece of that torn up sorcery. Ah, uh, say what? A magic spell. And it's nearly complete. Just one piece left. But yeah, if I do end up playing Dynasty Warriors 9, well, that I look forward to. <sighs> Probably annoying you, because I'll be horrible at it. Oh no wonder I've been having so much trouble finding anything around here. Good lad. Now off you go. I need you to wait at the entrance with the others. Sorry, I was yawning a lot there. I was trying to do something uh, to make it look like something was happening on the screen. <laughs> yeah, another kind of. I don't know. Janky go kart section? Not go kart. Oh my. Don't talk to me. No end to this there we go. Oh man. Die nice chow. I saw the kitty. Uh, the, the the kitty. The kitty. The kitty. The kitty. 
The kitty said something. No, I wanted the gem. Uh, the kitty said hi to you. I saw it. I have not seen your message. I'm sorry. Just give me one second, okay? Just one second. I have to say, not the most well-made minecart section I've seen in a video game. Not to bring up Donkey Kong Country again, but <laughs> this is... Uh... I'm kind of wondering if DuckTales... If the original DuckTales has minecart stuff, I wonder if Donkey Kong Country did it because of DuckTales. Like, I would not put that past them. I think that... That would be interesting. Like, you wouldn't think that, but you might. But you could. But you'd be wrong. Maybe. Okay, now we can read. Sorry. Pretty kitty icon. Oh, thank you. Oh, you haven't seen the kitty yet. Yeah, thank you. On the off chance you ever drop $60 on a game you don't really care about, I'll be here for you. <laughs> uh, don't worry. I wasn't going to spend $60. I... I when I put something on my Steam wish list, I usually wait for a sale of pretty significant amount. Like a hat in time right now, or just a day or two ago, was twenty ninety nine, I think. But I was like, no, that's not that's not enough. The base price is thirty dollars. I wanted to go down to five. Okay, I'm a cheapskate, I know. And pr uh, Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition is getting delisted on May 9th to make way for Dark Souls Remastered. But if you get Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition, you actually get 50% off of Remastered. So I was hoping that Prepare to Die would be at like a deep discount. But no. Nope. They're, they haven't done it yet at least, and that just makes me sad. This game is so cute. Thank you. I, I mean, I didn't make it. I don't know why I said thank you. Uh, but yes, it's... I really like it. It's charming. <clears throat> and uh, the art style is growing on me quite a bit, to be honest. Did he just say... Waka Flocka? Like the rapper? Okay, how? There's a way to do this. How do you do it? Uh-oh. How do you hit the chest from, like, here? How do you do it? Dainai's Chow, help me! I don't know how to get the chest. I am so scared of these things. Oh, whoa! Wait, excuse me? I can't get it. I can't get it. I can't get it. I can't get it. What the heck? Ow! Jeez! Oh, oh, maybe we have to go... Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, you got jokes today, don't you? You got jokes, Scrooge. You got all jokes. It's okay. At least we get some treasure here, right? Unless they're mimics. Oh, thank you, goodness. That's great, actually. Dang it! Oh, you can... You can kill it from that. Okay. Oh, man, okay. Let's get it. Oh, my gosh, really? So, how are you doing, Dionysus Chow? Did you hear about the Shadow of the Tomb Raider presentation? I'm really hoping you did because I didn't look anything up about it and I was hoping you would know <laughs> what what it was all about. I, I saw a thing about all the additions, like there are all these different additions they have, but not like any gameplay or anything. I didn't see the trailer, which I, I think there was a trailer. I'm hearing that it looks real dark, which I'm not opposed to. Depending on how they do the dark stuff. Did we already do this? I'm scared. Did I do this already? I'm gonna guess we've done this one. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, okay. That's good though. I mean, we got 
Got that. No! <laughs> so that whole thing about Dark Souls uh, meant is meant to illustrate that I'm a cheapskate when it comes to games on Steam. Why? Wait, why did I come back all the way here? Why? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? <gasps> it's a, it's ice cream. Give it to me. <clears throat> okay, I guess we have to do another one of these that I think we've done already. Scrooge? Can you jump? Do I need to give you some milk, bro? That was a reference. Only 90s kids will remember this one. Actually, I think it really was in the 90s. <laughs> Uh, for once, I make that joke, and it's actually from the 90s. It's, uh, it's that commercial for Got Milk, but it has these kids playing Super Mario 64, and he's not jumping, but then he suddenly drinks milk, and then he can jump really high or something like that. I don't know. I, don't know. I hope I didn't ruin it by, re by explaining the reference there. But. You gotta go do stuff, stream on, hero. Well, thank you so much for stopping by Downright Base. I'm really glad that we could connect. That's good. Thank you for stopping by. It was nice to see you. And I'll, I'll be on for a little bit while. A little <laughs> a little while longer, I should say. Um, because the stream is still quite young. And this is my big comeback stream. I gotta play so much, I gotta do a 24 hour stream. Just kidding, I'm probably not gonna do a 24 hour stream anytime soon. If ever. Okay. Where's our map? Okay, okay, cool, cool. Hey, thanks for the map! A little happy about that. <clears throat> uh, if. I, he's probably gone, but <laughs> uh, if you're still here, downright base, um, keep an eye out on the prices for Dynasty Warriors 9 on Steam, and let me know if you see anything happen. So many gems! Oh my gosh, he's still here! He did hear what my request was. Thank you. <laughs> I hope you have. Uh, I hope you have a good time doing whatever you're doing. Or I hope you get stuff done that you need to get done. I'm really bad at goodbyes. But don't worry. I'll I'll eventually be good at them. You know, my goodbyes on Twitch have been very, very good lately. Meaning, like, I don't spend the last 20 minutes of the stream saying goodbye. I've actually kind of tapered it down quite a bit recently, so that's good. I can't get over how Infinity War wasn't all I thought it would be. <laughs> yeah! It seems like that. <laughs> have you been... Deeply disappointed by any DC movies yet? <sighs> that was a really bad question. Please don't answer it. I don't want to know the truth. Because I know that you have. <clears throat> oh, I also got a game called Silent Hill Homecoming. Maybe gonna play that sometime. Probably not. I do not do well with horror games on stream. Okay. And uh, this will probably be the last level we do of this game for right now. Not so tough without your army helmet, eh? <laughs> Playing Silent Hill. Play Silent Hill now. No. 
No, I can't do that. Sorry. Uh, thank you, lad. That's not on the docket for tonight. Well, you better be careful where you go poking around, McDuck, or you're going to have much bigger problems than me. So long. Now, what do you suppose he meant by that? Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, quick, lad, see if there's a scrap of paper lying about. Ah, uh, you mean like this one, Uncle Scrooge? Exactly. This is the last piece of the riddle. But what to do? That's what I'm about to Um. Did you hear about the Aquaman trailer leaked? I don't. I didn't hear about a leak, but I heard about it was revealed at, at CinemaCon. And it wasn't a trailer, it was just some footage. I did hear a description of the footage. I'm a little worried at how coy they're being about the movie. The fact that it doesn't have a trailer yet. It's just, uh... A little, a little weird to me. <clears throat> I think the only official picture that was released was of Mera. And that happened quite a while ago. So I'm, I'm a little worried, actually. Did you hear about Henry Cavill wanting to play Superman? Henry Cavill wanting to play the character that he's been playing for the last four years? Five years, actually, I think. Four and a half. Yes, I meant the description. Oh, yes, then I did read that, yes. People were saying how he might not resign... Resign his contract. Um... But he debunked that. Oh, okay, good. Good, I mean, I like him as Superman, so that's good. <clears throat> Whoa. Oh, no, we've, we've been here before. Jeez, this level is very confusing. Not sure what... What I'm doing. He said he wants to keep playing Superman for as long as they let him. That's smart. That's very smart. The amount of money that he's getting for playing Superman is probably pretty tremendous. So I think that's a that's a good thing that he is smart enough to say that. <clears throat> Dang it, dude. the heck? Hold on. What? It's like... How do you get up there? How do you get in there? I don't get it. There's like a little thing, and you do the thing. You know? Do you think he would still play as Superman if the money wasn't good? No. I don't. At least I have a hard time believing he would. Because if he's not getting paid well for that, <clears throat> he might be... There, there are definitely other projects that he could be getting paid better for so that it would be kind of a waste of time for him I think we waited here just oh you told us, Uncle Scrooge. Well, you oh good have to wait much longer my dear now that I've got all three parts of the magic spell I'm one step away from finding Dracula's lost coin hold on a second I thought you said there's Scrooge no McDuck is Dracula. is an extremely well, greedy it's, it's been a rather informative day Greedy, uh, ornith, uh, creature. Never mind, kids. I'm going to find the treasure. And then <laughs> let me let me try and find a better word for that. Um, a duck on Wikipedia. Okay. 
Don't allow. I don't want them to know that I live in the Congo. Oh, what's that? Did I say that on stream? Whoopsie. Um, duck is the common name for a large number of species in the waterfowl family Anatidae, which also includes swans and geese. Okay, so he is quite the greedy waterfowl. That's, that's kind of where I was going with that. But he's really interested in Superman. Did he tell you that? <laughs> By the money wasn't good, I'm saying he's getting paid less than projects that he could uh, do el at the same time. But I, I, no, I just don't. I don't, I just, it, it's not. Nope. Nope. <clears throat> I, I, again, have a very hard time thinking that he would keep doing Superman if it wasn't being, if he wasn't getting paid well. He's a big enough actor that getting paid a lot of money is kind of the standard, I think. And if he just stopped getting paid that kind of money... He would maybe still play him, but I'm, I'm saying if the money got bad, like instead of getting paid a million to pay, play Superman, maybe he would be paid 20000 then, like, you can't get out of bed for $20,000 when you're playing Superman. That's just, that doesn't make sense. And I'm not, <laughs> one million is not a great amount, I know. I'm just using it as a kind of a reference tool like saying comparison tool saying hey if it were a million and then he got paid 20,000 instead it's it's a good uh, ratio to kind of hammer the point home I guess that was cool um he said it in the CinemaCon interview <laughs> But he's also under contract, probably. So saying... Saying that he doesn't want to play Superman... Saying he doesn't want to play the role that he's most well-known for... It's kind of biting the hand that feeds. So I don't, I don't entirely <laughs> trust that those were his sincere words. I think that it's probably just him saving face not trying to talk down on the role that made him who he is. Uh, do you think actors only care about money? Some do, some don't. Josh Hartnett is one that does not care about money. He stopped being in real high um, production value movies. He kind of shied away from that in favor of independent filmmaking. And... It's worked out really well for him. He's very happy. So there are some, yes, that do not care about money at all. But there are some that do care quite a bit about money. You read about it quite frequently, actually. I think recently there was a, a thing on Fifty Shades where they were demanding more money or something. I don't know. You hear about it all the time. I don't think they're doing it just for the money, but... If you make it big in Hollywood, you might as well do it for the money, to be honest. Because <laughs> it's so difficult to make it big in Hollywood. Uh, is there any actor that actually doesn't care about the money? Yes. Uh, Josh Hartnett's probably the best example I can give. Uh, I think Mia Was Wasikowska? I don't know. Her name looks like Wasikowska, but I heard it recently pronounced in a different way. So, Mia Wasikowska, she played Alice in the live-action Alice in Wonderland movies. Um, I don't think she cares about the money, because she's doing a lot of independent stuff as well. Um, I don't know. There, there are a lot out there. I'm, I, I think it's just the vocal minority cares so much about money, I think. Because I think more people care about the art and the craft of it than the money. So, 
yeah, but when you're when you're playing Superman, I think you care about the money. I do. If he didn't care about the money, he would probably sign on to so many independent movies. But he hasn't. Because he's Henry Cavill. Is there no end to this madness? I think Jennifer Lawrence might be heading towards... Eh, nah, no, that might be saying too much. Uh, I was going to say, I feel like she might be heading towards that same kind of thing where it's independent movies instead of really, really high production value ones. What the heck? I don't know what to do. Do you think they're actors that are sincerely interested in the character they play? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Um, <clears throat> Daniel Day-Lewis would be a great example of that, actually. Leonardo, Leonardo DiCaprio, I think, kind of toes the line, but I think he really does care. I mean, he hurt himself during filming of Django Unchained, and he kept going. I mean that's that's when you know they're they wanna they wanna do it for the the character and the art. But the money's nice. From the CinemaCon interview, I feel that Henry Cavill actually likes and is interested in playing Superman. I'll have to read it myself. Um. I think Robert Downey Jr. doesn't really care about Iron Man. I don't know if he doesn't. Well, I don't know if he doesn't care about Iron uh, about Iron Man. I think he just doesn't. Um. He doesn't care about. I don't know. He is a great example of someone that is doing it for the money I think <laughs> but I, I do think he cares about Iron Man but more because it pays for his million mansions you know um is there a Is there like a secret area down here or something? What am I doing? What do I do? I don't know what to do. Okay. Let's try and go... Let's try and go next to the thing? Maybe that's all we need to do. Okay, we'll try and go next to it. A little pulsating dot on the map. Um, you need to watch the interview. Henry Cavill wants to portray the version of Superman that's all about hope. You can tell that he reads comics. He even talked about his Mission Impossible director. Talked with his Mission Impossible director about doing a Man of Steel sequel. Oh, Christopher McQuarrie, right? Because I think I read about that. I think I read... Something about Christopher McQuarrie for Mission Impossible Fallout. No, not Mission... Man of Steel 2. Sorry. Man of Steel 2. Okay. Okay, so this is the way to go. Let's see? I don't know if Christopher McQuarrie would be able to do a Man of Steel sequel, though, without Tom Cruise being in the lead role. Oh, come on, doll. Gotta. There's, there's got to be something. There's got to be an opening somewhere. Oh my gosh! I don't like that. That's scary, dude. I don't like it. A 
Okay, here we go. If we can't find it here, then I don't know what to do. Wait, is that all it is? Just the... No! No. No, 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 no. No. You go under. Like an Evanescence song. We did it. Watch this. What a terrible map screen. I mean, it seemed like this area was completely off limits. <laughs> you had to teleport to it or something. Do you want me to link you the video? No. Thanks. I am gonna. I'll look for it myself. If that's okay. And if I'm right, using this spell will reveal the foul perpetrator behind all these shenanigans. Look for it now. I want to see your reaction. No, sorry. I have a stream to do. You wouldn't believe how much fun it is watching you run around making a I have games to play. What? <laughs> oh, you really don't think you need ancient sorcery to find coin of lost realm, do you? No. I had Beetle Boy's hide paper scraps to throw you off trail. Why, you sneaky conniving thief. From the video he gave garden party. No, sorry, what from the vibe he gave off. I will throw is that <clears throat> he sincerely cares about story. Superman. He said there are a lot of stories about Superman that he wants to tell. Okay. You said it, Webby. All right, you kids stay here. I'm going to track down that witch and give her a piece of my mind. Okay, this boss. Oh no. Wait, what? Oh, okay. It's just like, oh, oh wow, I didn't even see that. Oh, nice diamond. Do we have so much money? We could buy so much stuff for our duck pond. Oh, man. Oh, come on. <laughs> really? <sighs> okay. You will never see Robert Downey Jr. say that. Yeah. Probably not. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is good. Wah, wah. Yeah! Uh, ooh! Oh my gosh. It's Neki! It's Neki from Donkey Kong Country! Ooh! No! Oh shoot. I'm not, I should. Uh. Where is she? Oh, there she is. Okay. No, what the heck? Oh, I didn't notice that. Okay, my bad. Oh, man. This is not going... I actually, it's not going terribly. No! Come on. Okay, I don't want to jinx it. <laughs> Oh my gosh, please don't do that to me. Please stop. Oh man, oh wow! That was spooky. That was pretty cool, I like that element, that's fun. Oh, okay. Okay, come on. Yes! Hike! Okay. Oh man. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Slide. Yes. Mirror and 
these pills is the last time I shopped for spell ingredients at this count store. You what? haven't seen lots of magic at the spell. You may have coin of lost realm, but your number one dime will soon be mine. Alrighty. <laughs> nice. I wonder how many lives you get. In normal mode. Say, lad, folks like her have a way of popping up at the most inconvenient moments. Well, when it comes to magicka, there's no such thing as a convenient moment. Too true, Louis. Now then, where to next, lads? <clears throat> Let's see. What's the. Is the vault the. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to. Ah. Okay, we'll do one more dive in here and then we'll, uh. Oh, I can't stop thinking about the, the Family Guy episode. They make a joke about how <laughs> Peter jumps into a, a vault full of gold coins and he breaks all his arms and mouth and face. It's, uh, it's great. He's like, it's, it's a solid. It's not a liquid. <laughs> it's great. Oh, man. Okay, characters... Oh, okay. I see. Oh. TV show art. Cool. Characters. Um. It makes sense to get, get him. And then get that. Get that. And then get that. And then get that. That wasn't what I wanted, actually. Shoot. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful, actually. I love that. That is gorgeous. <laughs> oh, okay, so when I bought that one, it was all three of them. Okay, cool. Is that a rocket power logo on his chest? Strange. I love that. Oh man, that's great. Really? How many things do I have to buy? I think we have a little bit of a glitch going on. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, I wonder what the price is. I actually don't know what the price is now because it could be 150,000, it could be 175,000, 150, 355, 195. What a strange glitch! Huh. How silly. I think we might. No, uh, we won't be able to get all of these, unfortunately. Oh, I just noticed that it unlocked the concept art. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> I wonder if you're able to get all this in one playthrough. I don't know. Because you can't replay a level, I don't think. 
Like, it won't let you go back to any other levels. That's strange. Hmm. Alright. Uh, assuming it's saved, I think it did. Uh, we're gonna call that a game that is done for the night. <clears throat> and now we must find something else to play. Thirty-one minutes. Number one, really? Huh. Usually on these leaderboards for really old games, it's just kind of... It's standard to see hacked scores, but no, it seems fine. Dang it. <laughs> oh. 